I'm just grateful that we were there because I've known Victor pretty much my entire life. He's like my brother. A weekend of friendly competition on the slopes turned on its head in an instant as two members of Castleton University's Alpine race team watched their friend from Babson College make his first run. But unfortunately, he doesn't pass us, but more like crashes it right into us. I just heard screaming. I heard my dad screaming. And then I hear tourniquet and I immediately was like, we need to do something. Freshman Victor Wycheck had fallen onto his own ski, badly cutting his left leg. When Kylie Mackey and Lynn Lungimo saw the blood and the snow, they knew they had to act fast. Me and Kylie start sprinting towards Victor and just start stripping off uh, whatever we have on because we're just thinking that whatever we have, like we're going to use it on him. I realized I had a windbreaker on, so I tied it around his leg as tight as I could. The teammates are each first aid certified through the Red Cross, and their makeshift tourniquets help stop the bleeding long enough for Wycheck to be brought to a nearby hospital where he needed surgery, transfusions, and dozens of stitches. I kept feeling like tears coming and like my control of my emotions kind of getting away from me, but then I, I'd look at Lynn and my dad and be like, I can't cry right now, like I have to keep it together for Victor. Mackie and Wycheck grew up learning to race together, and she says the crash has only brought them closer. We just go on and on about how grateful we are for each other. And Wycheck says he'll never be able to thank his friends enough. Words will never, ever be sufficient. I, I, don't, I don't think I can say anything really, just uh, I think uh, I've had, I have so, so much gratitude. But the day wasn't quite over for the Castleton racers. After checking in on Wycheck, they each completed their next run, with Lunglimo taking first place. We didn't even know if we wanted to continue racing that day, but because he told us to, we decided to do it for him. I didn't care what happened. I didn't care about my results. All I cared was that, like, he's okay. Wycheck is recovering and hopes to be back on his skis as soon as possible. Now Mackie and Lunglimo each have their eyes set on qualifying for nationals. In Castleton, Ross Ketchke, NBC5 News. <laughs>